Abby's feeling a little down. It's been storming again. Yes. And look at those ears she has. She can hear everything miles away. And when she hears the storm coming, you know what I mean by that. Okay, I'll say the word. She doesn't like when I say it. Thunder. She's afraid of thunder. Although the lightning is what could hurt her. It's okay. You don't have to leave. It's not thundering, honey. Oh, she, it rained. Yes. Come here, Abby. Come here, baby. Oh, she left us. So her, you know, being afraid of things like that. Even when I say rain, she goes and hides because she knows that's associated with thunder. She's not afraid of ceiling fans anymore. We have that to take the heat somehow in the house, feeling down, bringing the heat down from the up area. So, and we got this from where my husband works. It's a sleeper sofa. This mattress is pretty much ruined though. So we ordered one online. See, the mattress has a hole. And this is one of those old mattresses that actually has the old springs in it. If someone wanted to invest to get it reupholstered, but oh man, it would cost more. I don't know how we're going to we might do the trash to get rid of it, and we might put it out that if someone wants it, to reupholster it. But we're getting one online, so. And I want to say that I'm not taking down the video where I said about YouTube counting lines, or not counting. Um, I say lines because that's how it was for transcription. I meant not count, counting. Not counting views. Let's see where Abby went. Not counting views. I don't know if that's true. Oh, there she is, our little sweetheart. It's dark in here. You like the dark? Okay, I'll let you in here. I love you, Abby. All the noises scare her. Isn't she a beauty, though? That's our baby girl. We have that little heater there. That besides her there, it's a burgundy color. It was from the camper. So if it gets cold enough, I'll plug that in to shower. And we're getting a bed frame for this mattress we got from a friend at church. And we're getting a mattress for the sofa bed. We got free the sofa. It's probably from the 90s. It's not leather. It's pleather, if you ever heard of that. The fake, like, plastic leather. But it's in good shape. So when my grandson comes up from Alabama here to Kansas, he can stay there. So... And I'm doing laundry today. And we do want to get new bottoms because this smells musty when you open. You can, there's no smell of vision yet, but when you open, you can smell mustiness. I don't know what that's from, but we'll discover. We'll get in there, my husband and I, and find out when we rip it out. And the washer and dryer is going. But I want to apologize because that video, I'm not taking it down, but I was upset. And I said, and I lied, I'll say it, I lied, because I said, I'm never watching Tim Tracker and uh, Adam the Woo, the Daily Woo again. But I miss, especially the Daily Woo, Adam's voice, just what he shows us. He's so kind-hearted and loving, and my husband is, but we don't talk as much. And Adam talks about everything that he shows you, whether it's Disney, Alaska, now he's in Las Vegas, he was. And I'm never going to get to Las Vegas. Las Vegas. It's a 22-hour drive. So I'm not going there because I'm not flying. After that airline I went on last time and how, like, sardine it was. No way am I doing that again. So I'm expecting my gift for Christmas today. My husband ordered it early. Of course, I know what it is, but... He said it was in transit. It was on its way from Pittsburgh Kansas, so that's only about a half hour away from here, but it's coming UPS, the brown guys, and they probably have a lot of stops on the way, so I'm thinking three hours. There's my baby girl. Come here, baby girl. Come here. Don't be afraid. It's nice outside today. The sun is shining. Look at you stretching out. So right here is where I cleaned out the corner. 
There's Abby looking out the window. I didn't get new curtains in this room yet. Or that room. They're the shears yet. And I can't wait till I can get some. We're going to get it. By and by, we'll get all the stuff. But my gift's coming today. And it's going to be in that corner. I moved that table over to there where we charge our laptops. And my gift's going to go right there. So I apologize for lying because I cannot go without watching Adam the Woo. It's, I'm not addicted to it. Well, maybe I am. But what's wrong with that? He's a kind-hearted, loving person. And I'm here in Kansas in the middle of the country. And he's in um, Celebration, Florida, way down there, probably only a few miles from my sister-in-law that's like 71 or no, she turned 72 on Thanksgiving Day. So 72-year-old um, sister-in-law lives in po Point Siana, Point Siana, somewhere in there. And then my brother-in-law, my husband's one older brother, actually his oldest, lives in Winter Haven, Florida. I love Florida. I want to know what's going on. And he tells you what's going on. And that's why... I have to watch him, you know. YouTube does make a lot of money. That's where my gift's going, right? There. So, YouTube, Adam the Woo tells you what's going on, and he's so kind and gentle and sweet about it. I'm 67. He just turned 50. I could be his mom if I had a kid at age 17. And I could, well, I was 18 when I finally decided I would throw my body on some guy. <laughs> just to make light of it, because how dumb are you when you're, 18 years old. Think back if you're older, the 18 year old stuff. And we'll pray for today's world because the stuff that's going on today with the 18 year olds, ugh. Ay, 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 to use Ricky Ricardo, Desi Arnaz, Babalu. <laughs> I love that show too. I actually did a marathon. I watched like 20 shows in a row the other day of Lucy. I think she's on, um, what are those stations? Roku? I think it's on that. Don't take my word for that, but I love watching her, too. I know they're both dead and gone, but they had such a powerful love, even though they got divorced. And their shows are funny. She is so funny. She probably is up in heaven dancing. She pretended she couldn't sing. Or dance well, but she could. She was great at all that. And how humble could she be? Because she loved Ricky so much. She loved Desi so much, so very much that she would do that for him on their show. And it was a wonderful show. All clean cut, nice stuff. So I'm just apologizing because I said I'm never watching those two again, but I will. My husband doesn't watch them. He has no interest but we're not alike, and there's nothing wrong with that. But as far as being upset with you two, I still am. Because I do believe they say that they might be doing that. But I think in my own head, whether it's a conspiracy theory or not, that they might be not counting everyone's views. But that's not on me. That's on them. When I first was videoing, I had a video that might have had two, three hundred views. They put a commercial on it. And I got upset about that. I shouldn't have. It's their company. They do what they do. They pay 45% of whatever revenue from those ads and things to the person. And I know that my favorite YouTubers make pretty good money. I just wanted to make a little spending money, but I believe for sure that's not going to happen. But I'm just apologizing for lying that I said I wasn't going to watch Adam the Woo, the Daily Woo, or Tim Tracker again. And that's a lie, because I'm going to watch it. Please forgive me. And I'm so excited to get my package. I might share that video with you guys when I open my package. So I hope you're having a wonderful day. You just keep singing, dancing, making music, and having fun as much as possible. Pray for the world and all of us. We need it.